high fire signs Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those cross watching. In today's reading, we're going to take a look and see what you can expect within the next 24 to 48 hours. It is going to be a general reading, so keep that in mind. If you're after a personal one, feel free to reach out and um, connect. My email address is going to be listed below the video. Okay, with all of that being said, let's go ahead and let's take a look and see what might the next 24 to 48 hours bring. Okay. Some of you have recently connected uh, with someone or you might have already been in an existing relationship with this person. You could be doing long distance or you might have recently connected with someone who is at a distance from you. Okay, romantically. So someone who lives in a... Um, in a, like a different city, in a different state or even a different country. Um, if this is recent, then you need to know that there is opportunity for some for this to be so much more. There's opportunity for growth, there's opportunity for expansion, there's opportunity for you guys to build on this. Um, for others of you, you will be connecting with someone, okay? You might potentially connect with someone um, on a dating app or on a social media platform, but it just feels like, yeah, this is long distance. It feels like this is someone at a distance. Um, and it just also feels like, you know, you need to know that there is opportunity for this to be so much more than what you might think at first. Some of you, I'm also seeing travel on the cards. Some of you are traveling, but an opportunity might pop up, okay? Um, very unexpectedly and very last minute, but for others of you, I feel like it's been planned, it's been organized, you're traveling. Um, there could also be delays, actually. There could be delays with this travel. Uh, there could be delays... Something here could be delayed for you. And it could be something as little, for example, if you've been doing some online shopping, your parcels or your packages could be getting delayed. If you've been anticipating and waiting to receive contact or communication from someone, you've been waiting to hear back, um, whether it's you know a text message or a phone call or an email, it's still coming through. So just because something's delayed, it's not denied, but oh okay. But it's just it's taken it's it's taken a while to reach you, whatever this is. Okay? Um I'm also seeing that there's something here that you need to, you might need to take a look at and approach it from a different angle. I don't know if this is a specific um, task or a project that you're working on. I don't know if this is like an assignment um, or if it's like a relationship, a connection of some sort. You need to look at things differently. That you've hit a stumbling block. You've hit a, a bit of a brick wall, a bit of a dead end, something. So whatever it is that you've been doing, um, it hasn't necessarily been working out for you up until this point, right? Um, and, you know, this is why you've hit a bit of a stagnation. However, if you try and switch things up and look at things from a different perspective, okay? So, for, for example, I'm going to take, if you're working on a project and if you've just been, you know, hacking away at it again and again and again, put it away. Put it away, distract yourself with something else, go do something that, you know, is completely not associated with whatever it is that you're working on, and then, you know, a day or two, go back later and look at it from a very, like, with a, with a fresh perspective, look at it very differently, and then you're finally going to figure out what isn't working or why you've hit this roadblock, okay? I'm also seeing that there's something here, so you've been planning or you might have plans for the next 24 to 48 hours, whether it's like a dinner date or whether it's plans to go out with a friend and catch a movie, something isn't going to go according to your plans, but it's going to, but don't, don't fret because it's going to work out just as good, if not better. Okay. So if the universe, you know, throws a wrench, um, throws a spanner in the works or if the universe you know decides to switch things up on you don't don't stress i just feel like whatever it is it's going to turn out to be a very memorable event or very memorable night um so just just go with it basically just go with it because i feel like with the ten of cups energy i just feel like this is something that's going to bring you you know if you let it if you just let yourself be present in the moment it's something that's it's going to be a very memorable occasion
Okay, some of you might be blocking someone or someone has blocked you here. No contact, no communication. And maybe you need, maybe it's you, maybe you're blocking someone because you need to figure some things out. And if you have contact with this person, they're just going to further confuse this already confusing situation. Maybe you're going to get a bit of a reality, um, like a, a bit of a shock when you're going to find out that someone here has blocked you out of the blue. And it's like, you know, I, I don't think you're going, I think you're going to be more surprised than anything. I think a lot of you won't even care. But it's just like, why? That has, a, and that whole blocking thing has a lot to do with this person being a little bit childlike, a little bit immature. Um, I think the next 24 to 48 hours for you um, are looking good for the most part. You've got the sun's energy. There's some wonderful, I feel like you're feeling good. I feel like you're in a, you're attracting, you're attracting good energy, good vibes. I think you're in a very good position here to um, attract what it is that you want. Okay, so um, your energy is feeling very alluring and very attractive right now. Okay, ride that high. Okay, ride that wave. It just feels like, you know, you're feeling good. You're looking good. You're attracting good. So why not? Um... Nine of Pentacles as well. Some of you, I feel like uh, you're putting in, I see you putting in a little bit more time and a little bit more care and effort into your, into yourself. Okay, so whether it is that you decide to work out a little bit more, whether it is that you decide to, you know, just do some, you know, do some things that you really enjoy and that you feel like it nourishes your soul. I just see you investing a little bit more time into yourself. I also feel like there's something here that you've been working on very hard, okay? Um, you've been putting in a lot of work and effort into whatever this is for you. I see that there's a payout coming your way. So, yeah, it could be financially, okay? There could be financial rewards and financial results that are coming your way. Um, and I feel like I see you feeling pretty good about yourself, okay? Um, I see you feeling pretty proud about your, your achievements, your hard work, um, for others, it's not necessarily financial gains or financial results, but I feel like there's something here that's finally paying off for you. It's like, yes, you finally get to see the results, you know, after all the hard work that you've been putting in. There's someone here around you who I feel like is very resistant. Uh, I feel like this person it has a very resistant energy. I don't think it's you. I don't think it's you. Um, at least I don't think that. But I think it's someone close to you. So it could be a romantic energy. It could be like a boss, um, a connecting energy, a friend, a family member. There's some sort of plans that you have going on. Some plans, intentions, or expectations. And you're feeling good about them. Okay, whatever those plans are. You're feeling pretty good about it. But this person, this person is offering up resistance. Um, and that's important for you to know. Because I feel like they could potentially serve as... A blockage or as an obstacle in your plan so if this person isn't on board with whatever it is that you're wanting to work on or whatever it is that you're wanting to carry out it's probably you know it's probably a good thing it, it's not a good thing to force don't force fit anything it might just be a good thing to you know let them make up their mind about it Children are also going to be, I feel like children are also going to be a big focus for you the next 24 to 48 hours. Some of you are spending more time with your kids. Some of you are going to have to, I don't know if you're like, you might be babysitting. Um, I just feel like your yeah, children are going to be big. Or you're going to be, you have your hands tied with children here. I feel like you've got your hands um, tied. Um, you're pretty busy. Children are going to require your attention here. Notice how you've got the sun as well that's appeared twice. And this is illumination. So within the next 24 to 48 hours, something he might be revealed to you. Something he might be illuminated to you. So 
this very thing might be might have been under your nose all along but you just didn't realize it and all of a sudden it's going to start making sense it's almost like some of you are getting this like aha moment this light bulb moment okay could have something or could have a lot to do with the fact that you are approaching things from a different angle you're switching things up you're seeing things um, from a fresh perspective you're deciding to do things differently you're deciding to take a different approach um, you know you've left something aside and then you've gone back to it and you see it very differently um, and it could it could be that it could be some things becoming illuminated to you and it might be something that you know was there all along you just never happened to see it and all of a sudden it's just you know you become a lot more receptive and open to it could also have something to do with your energy you know you're feeling good you're attracting good and you could be attracting the right people the right information the right like situations as well all right guys and these are your messages thanks so much for watching and listening please show your support by liking sharing and subscribing bye